Hi, this is Steph Mischuk with KillerSites.com and KillerPHP.com. In this quick little video, I want to answer a question that was recently put to me by somebody. And uh, I think it's a question that a lot of aspiring PHP programmers or PHP developers would be interested in hearing. And the question is, do you need a PHP certificate to get a job as a PHP programmer? The short answer to that question is it depends on the type of work that you're going to be looking for. Let me just get to the point. If you're looking to work for a large organization, I'm talking a big company where they have an HR department, a human resources department, then PHP certification will be much more important than if, for example, you wanted to start a independent a PHP firm where you're doing contract work for instance. So getting back to the large organization, typically any large business, whether it be a private business or government, they're going to be much more concerned about your certification, your degrees, than a smaller companies. And definitely if you're going out there as a freelancer or opening up a firm, you won't they won't even ask you about these things. It's 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 the last thing they consider. So to recap, if you're looking to work for a larger business, certification becomes more important. It's not necessarily a deal breaker. Uh, typically larger businesses, the first thing they're gonna look for is whether or not you have a bachelor's degree. At the end of the day though, whether you're looking for a job in a large company or in a small company, the most important thing that you're gonna need to have is experience and a provable track record. So I always tell people who are getting into, the, whether you're getting into the business of web design or you want to get into PHP programming or any technology, that you need to go out there and build sites, write scripts, create projects. This is the most important thing. So one option for you if, if you're getting out of school or why you're just learning PHP is to um, is to take on small jobs. There are a lot of small businesses out there who need simple things done, simple shopping carts or even simple mailers, these kind of things. And modifying a blog that's PHP based, whether it be WordPress or, um, or, or something like Drupal or something, which is a, a content management system. The point is, is you want to get some coding hours under your belt so that you can show people that you actually know what you're doing. When I look at people, you know, when I'm hiring people for my for killer sites, the first thing I look at really is their experience. I do glance at the resume to see what they've done, but in terms of uh, uh, how I weight it, in terms of the overall equation, uh, I give it maybe 10% weight, 15% weight personally. I'm much more concerned about their experience in the field and what kind of projects they've worked on. And because I'm a nerd, I actually look at the code that they've written. I want to see that the code is clean, that it's modular, that it's well commented, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So again, it comes back to whether or not you have good experience that you can show people. So certification helps, definitely it helps, but experience trumps that. So there you go.